Hey guys, this is Chris from Money Peach, and I'm going to show you really quick how you can take your spreadsheet that I gave you and how you can get it onto your phone so you can access it from anywhere in the world anytime on the go. So there's one of two ways you can do this. The first way is using Google Drive, and the second way is using Dropbox. And I'm going to share with you both ways right now. So using Google Drive, if you have a Google Drive account, go ahead and open it and create a folder for where you're going to stick your budget. For example, for me, I'm going to create a folder called Budget. Once you have that folder created, go ahead and drag over your budget into that folder and then open up your budget. This is going to show you just where it's stored. However, you can't click on any of these items in here. This is just a viewable screenshot. If you want to actually edit your budget, you want to go over here where it says open. Click on that and that's going to open in a program called Google Sheets. Now we officially have your budget up in the cloud. This is where I highly suggest you actually keep it because that way you never have to worry about losing it and you can always get to it and edit it from any computer or even on the go. Now let me show you how you actually get this on your phone. So this is an iPhone example, and it kind of shows you what it will look like in your home screen. So on your home screen, you're going to have two apps you're going to want to download. One is called Sheets, and one is called Drive. Drive is where your budget is actually stored, but you can't do anything in it. Sheets is where you're actually going to be able to open up your budget and enter it on the go. So once you click on Sheets, you're going to come to this screen here. The one on the bottom, that is the Google Drive document. You can go ahead and delete that if you'd like. You're not going to be able to use that. The one on the top, now this is your actual budget. And then when you open it up, voila, you have it in your phone. Now you can take it and you can enter it on the go. Just remember, anytime you want to use your budget, now you want to go to either Google Sheets on your iPhone or Google Sheets using your Android. Now I'm going to share with you another way you can use your phone on the go, and that's with using Dropbox. Very similar to Google Drive, open up a Dropbox, and once you're inside Dropbox, go ahead and take your budget, and I want you to just drag it on over inside your Dropbox files. No need in creating a folder here. Go ahead and open your budget. Again, just like in Google Drive, this is just simply a document you can look at, but you're not going to be able to actually edit your budget at all until you go over here and you open it inside Microsoft Excel Online. Go ahead and click on that. When you get to this screen here, just go ahead and click on edit a copy, and then you can name your budget whatever you want. So for this example, we'll just leave it Money Peach Spreadsheet Budget. But like I said, it's anything you want to call it. It's your budget. And then also click on replace existing file. And there you have it. Now you have your budget in the cloud online using the Excel Online program. So this is again where I would suggest you go and you edit and you do all your budgeting is actually inside here. So that way if you ever lose a copy, you always have it stored up in the cloud. Now let me show you how to actually do this on your phone. So you're going to need to still get two more apps. One app is called Dropbox, and one's called Excel. They're both free. So Dropbox, remember, this is just simply where you store your budget. Excel, this is where you're actually going to do all your editing and all your budgeting on the go. So let's go ahead and open up Excel. When you open up your Excel, you're going to find your budget is in there. Go ahead and click on the budget, and there you have it. It's back in here. It's back on your phone, and you can edit it on the go. So just remember, whenever you're opening your budget, you're going to use Excel in this situation. All right, guys, happy budgeting, and go get them.